because I love donuts. <laughs> <laughs> making really good progress. Keep going, keep going. You only have 12 more levels before you reach prime seizure potential. Yeah, this is fun. You right? You know, like fun that we had at home back when you used to tell me things. Like, where do you live? Start that again. I'm not starting anything. I'm just saying there's fun to be had all the time with me, your best friend. It's time to go to high school. George, don't do the whispering under your breath thing. If you got something to say, just say it. Yeah, last time you gave me that advice, it went really well. You're seriously pissed at me because of what happened between you and Meredith. No. Yeah. I told you to tell her how you feel. I did not tell you to jump into bed Why with her. Why didn't you tell her? Adultery. Why did you send me in there? Was it to humiliate me? No. I mean, if you knew that she didn't love me, why? What, what kind of friend does that? You didn't want to hear it. it. Yes, yes, I'm in some denial. I can over that. You wanted to keep on loving her, George. You did not want to hear it. My God. You knew the risk stopped. You knew she was in love with someone. I'm getting right? an aura. I'm not saying that what she did wasn't wrong. No! I am not saying that what she did wasn't wrong. I am just saying you need to take a tiny piece of you are ridiculous. She's seizing. Go Paige Shepard. Well, the bad news is you had a ground mall seizure. The good news is we mapped it, so now we can operate. No. But I've decided against surgery, Dr. Shepard. I'm sorry. No offense. The risks of craniotomy, it's, when you describe them, they're not terribly appealing. Yes, there are risks. But you have to weigh those risks with the uh, detrimental effect your seizure disorder has on your life. Unless my life is having a detrimental effect on my seizure disorder. All right, my point is, I had more fun today than I, I can remember. I don't have any friends. I don't have any fun. I only have work. Work and seizures. And it's no coincidence that when the work stopped, the seizures stopped. Until these two started arguing. All right, I'm going to talk to him about that. <clears throat> no, you don't get it. Watching people fight, ugh. That's been my whole life for 15 years. So I'm changing my life. Look, and if that doesn't work, I'll come back here and let you cut open my brain, okay? All right, fair enough. I hope it works. You're changing your life. So do I. Hey, George. I don't know much, but I do know fighting. And people who fight, like you and Izzy, those people love each other. She misses her friend. What he meant is, nothing comes without a price. George! Hey! Hey. Oh, hi. Hey. So we spent the night at Callie's last night. So we figured we'd just spend the night here. Um, okay, so um, you're back then just for tonight? Well, Callie's here for the night. I'm, uh, I don't know. It's my room. Pay you rent. Know. Welcome home. When we don't have time to come up with a strategy to pick a side or to measure the potential loss, 